Welcome to the demonstration of Retina Vector and CorelDRAW and how to fix uh, DXF files. So some of you might have been having problems um, importing DXF files. So let me open up a, a DXF file. So here's CorelDRAW X5 and uh, this DXF file I think was uh, generated by TurboCAD. So here we just import it um, we open it and it looks fine in Corel Draw, but if we hit File Print and um, we print to the Full Spectrum Engineering Driver, and uh, let's see what happens. So it looks like the drawing was imported incorrectly and it was screwed up. Uh, so there's a very specific reason for this, and um, let's uh, investigate. So if we zoom into some of these corners, uh, we can see these lines are not exactly joined up. So here we, we can see here, like, these two lines are actually two separate lines and they don't form a closed vector path. So this uh, creates a problem. In CorelDRAW this is really easy to fix so what I'm going to do is select all the points and use the arrange menu and use join curves and hit apply and uh, that's basically it. Um, I'm going to do file print I'll print it again and um, now you see the drawing is imported correctly so that's all you need to do uh, range and join the curves and you will import flawlessly uh, let me show some other features so if I select this object and I hit this hairline tool, we should always use the hairline outline. And I'm going to select this, and down here I can change the color. So I'm going to change this to, uh, to red. And I'm going to do File, Print again. And now you see it comes through and we have an extra layer. So we can set the order of this layer um, second and reduce the speed to say 50% and the power to 10%. And um, all we do is hit cut now and it will start cutting.